and welcome to my science lab. Bounce. Today we're making experiments about capillary action. Capillary action. Capillary action. Capillary action. The materials are five cups of water, food coloring, and tissue. For our color, we need yellow and blue and red. We call these primary colors. Primary colors. Primary colors. Primary colors! Now let's begin. <laughs> Step 1. Align the cups properly. First cup. Second cup. Third cup. Fourth cup. And fifth cup. Pour in water in the cup. First cup. First cup. Third cup. And fifth cup. Let's pour in water. Coloring in the cups with water. Red here, yellow here, and blue here. Make sure to mix it properly. First, Two hours later. Step four. You get a tissue paper and then you make it into a square. And then you fold it in half. Until it gets small. And then bend it and then put it in the cups. One, two, three, go. Oops, you must take a close look when I put the tissue in the cups. Ready, go. You can see the color, the food coloring color is going up the tissue and going to the empty cup. It's going up against gravity. Yes, it's going up against gravity. We call this effect as capillary reaction. It is ability to flow in a narrow tube. Climbing like we can overcome gravity. Remember when we studied plants? How do plants get water? This is how it works. Capillary action does this. Water travels in the roots going up, up, up at the stem going different parts. Now let's see what happens to our hat 
and three cups. See? Red and yellow makes orange and blue and yellow makes green. And that's all for today's experiment. Thank you for watching! Bye-bye!